rainy day today here in Shanghai. Walking down Nanjing Road, heading to the metro station. Gonna meet Mr. Nick Tuck, and uh, we're gonna head off to the markets. Science and technology markets is where you get all the copy, fake products. It's online too. You just take the stop to the Science and Technology Museum and the markets are right there when you get off the train. Lesson on the metro. Any particular exit doesn't matter. It doesn't. Seven or eight are always good. And then we're literally right here. So these markets right on the Science and Technology Museum stop on line two is an amazing place where you get all sorts of handbags, t-shirts, belts, purses, wallets, um, phones basically anything you could imagine. Um, it's really what you think of when you think of um, Chinese markets and copy markets and things like that. It's definitely the place to come uh, for that sort of thing. There's also a pearl market and a glasses market. So uh, really is no end to the type of product that you can get here. And it's just fascinating to look around even if you're not um, buying anything. It's really just good to look at all the different types of products that, that you can get. And uh, they love a good bargain here. So, uh, you know, first rule of negotiating is uh, never accept the first price. Um, and uh, that's part of the fun of these markets is uh, having a bit of a haggle and seeing if you can get um, a really good price for your Parada handbag. Tell me how much this. Uh, the price of this one we see is like this. How about the discount? Yeah, yeah, no, it's crazy. It's, it's crazy, crazy price. But this is product is good. Yeah, no, 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 no. This, you're, you're telling me silly prices. I, I have the outside of no, the Jimmy Choo. No, no, no. Chiu it's only, only $150. $150. Maybe you, you buy you're the You're telling me the silly Mowbray, price. Mowbray or Jimmy Choo, okay. You're telling me the wrong price. Like how many you want to buy? Huh? How many you buy now? Will you tell me a good price? Okay. Because I, I'm saying 150, you're telling me 800. It's a crazy price. I'm not playing okay, this price. Okay, I understand. I didn't say 800. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, if we buy more than one, what yeah, about yeah. Uh, what about for one? What about this? For one? No, 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 no. no. What's your best price? Well, I tell you, 150. So how many you buy? I buy two. Two. So 300. So 300. For that's two. your price, yeah. right? Yep. No. No. No any more? No. Okay. Do it. Which color? Both colors. Those two, right? Okay. Uh, color. Bright. Bright color. Yeah, bright color. Okay, you choose which color you want. Uh, yellow, green, blue, and pink. Pink. Pink, pink is good. Very blue. Is it a very good price? Of course. How much did you buy before? I think 60 each. Really? Price is very cheap. Which color? Orange. orange. You don't have orange. I orange. don't have orange. So you want orange or you want a purple? Mm, maybe I should get that. If you give me very good price, maybe, maybe I'll get four. Maybe I'll buy four. Yeah, if you give me very good price. Really oh, that is quite nice. Yeah, we feel a lot better. Put the camera through. Oh, did you? <laughs> Here now in the French concession area, taking uh, the Shanghai Library stop off on line 10. Uh, Nick had to stop and get some cash, but uh, also a bit of a scene going on. Uh, there's also plenty of uh, cool restaurants around. 
Um, so you're never too far away from uh, finding something um, something good to eat. So this part of town is um, there's lots of uh, Westerners around here. It's a bit of an ex expat community. Uh, but there's lots of cool things to do, and um, we're here to um, find um, a secret DVD shop. The area is well known for its tree-lined streets, its quirky little shops and restaurants and lots of interesting little antique shops but also lots of uh, local food and local shops for hardware and things like that oh wow that's pretty cool like eh? a bamboo bike yeah. huh? it is cool being a little bit overly dramatic about the secret nature of the uh, DVD store uh, it's actually a shop called Big Movie that's got any movie you want No, it's okay, I'll use this bag. Okay. Thank you. Mm. I think it's fair to say now I'm in a Chinese movie. I think it's coming out in time for Christmas. Should be a winner. Head to Nick's favourite spot on Anfu Lu called Baker and Spice. Uh, great for a coffee, baked goods, breakfast, lunch, just all round top shop. Definitely a great place. I'd give it a thumbs up. Yeah, so there's all sorts of sort of quirky um, shops and restaurants. Uh, you never quite know what you're going to find. Did have you thinking there for a minute, though, didn't I? Right, time to head back to the metro and and head off 